Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Madden 18 Ultimate Team, and today we're going to be going over the new chemistry cards real quick. Uh, not too much to say on it. And then we have Twitch Prime Pack, Elite Fantasy Reward Pack, and the Gauntlet Tro- or we won't be opening those. I'm going to wait till I finish up the actual ga new Gauntlet, and then we'll go over that. But we have Chemistry 101 Packs here. They give you 470 plus overall gold or better players with the chosen chemistry. I'll even open up one for you guys. I know, using a little coinage here, but I'll open up one. Blanket coverage, that's my coverage, so we'll rip this bad boy. See if we can pull an elite. Okay, okay, Mark Barron. Not bad. Oh, another elite. Okay, JJ Wilcock, okay. Pack was straight fire, bro. I opened one up earlier, and it was just some straight trash. I was like, okay, whatever. That's not bad. Let's take a look at these prices real quick. I need to sell this Devin McCourt. I like sold my whole team because there's like no point. Like online head to head is like complete not fun at all. So, okay, Mark Barron. All right, 11k. So we're looking at about 10k there after tax. So 10k for Barron. And where is there's JJ Wilcox. I also opened up the level 27 pack. It was not okay. So we essentially we didn't pay for that pack, but not a bad not a bad pack. But um. Uh, I opened my level 27 pack and I chose the Andy Jankovic. Nothing special there. There was nothing I needed or wanted. Uh, so let's get into these chemistry solos real quick. So there's 84 solos, each chemistry. We'll just need to go over one of these, so pound the rock. Uh, you need tier 4 chemistry to get to the end where you will get tiers 1, 2, 3, and tier 4 chemistry trophy items. Uh, you'll get uh, 11,000 for completing each of these if you do the math. Uh, there are uh, seven chemistries. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are seven chemistries. So it's about 80,000 coins. Uh, but that's all you get out of it. There's no cards. It's just coins. And then we come over here to the upgrade sets. And we have chemistry 101 cards. You get to choose if you want them auctionable. And they're at a lower overall. Or non-auctionable, tradable. And they're higher overall. So you got Dwayne Allen and uh, Jer Jared Davis, Gerard Davis. You got Mike Tolbert and Star Lutalele. I don't know if Tolbert is listed as a halfback in this game or a fullback. That would kind of change on whether or not I want him. You also get chemistry of your choice, and it's times two, so that's really nice. Um, Smith, uh, Tory Smith or George Iloka, 83 auctionable or 85 non-auctionable tradable. Probably want the 85 non auctionable tradable Tory Smith. That thing's probably got decent speed. And then you got Lynch or Hayden. You want the 88 overall. The 86 sell for about 100k, but you want that 88 overall Joe Hayden. Uh, probably the best option out of all of that. Um, we got the new predictors. I don't know if I'm going to get them done. I did not get week threes done. That's my bad. I just didn't. I, I didn't even open up the. I had the packs, and I just never opened them up and put them in the set. Uh, and so I'll try to get these done. I, I think I, I got 24 both weeks. 23 plus. I, th I think I got 23 week one and then 24 there. Uh, so not bad at all. And so now time for the big packs. So first we'll open up the Twitch Prime. It's a nice, quick, easy video going over the Chemistry 101. So there's my token. And we get Richard Dent right end. So the point this is kind of pointless because we already have the Reggie White. Most people, I don't have the Reggie White. But most people already have the Retro White, and we just got the Ziggy Ansa, so that's kind of the issue with that card right there. But let's get into this. This is the most important thing, the Elite Fantasy Reward Pack. We want that 86 plus, non-auctionable, non-tradable. All right, here we go. Give me, give me, give me something good. Something good. Okay. <clears throat> not, not, uh, not, no, never mind, that sucks. I have a right guard. I have that Shaq Mason, so that sucks. <clears throat> I was like semi hyped, and then I remembered I had Shaq Mason. So uh, I don't really know what I'm gonna do with him. Um, guess I could put one of them at right tackle. Though they kind of suck at right tackle, huh? Well, that's not good. Um, well. So my luck, my my awful luck out of these packs continues. It it continues. Um, let's see. 
Do I need... I do not need Shaq Mason for the Pound the Rock chemistry. Okay. That means that... Okay, fine. I'll play I'll play Kevin Zeitler. I, I want one of the good offensive line, so... I guess that's alright, and I guess Shaq Mason can be the backup. Everywhere. For this position only. And then I can put Shaq Mason here. Okay, so, uh, eh, it's not good. I can't say I'm happy with that pull. It's pretty trash, but it doesn't help me at all because I have this Shaq Mason. But it's all right. It's better than pulling, like, a quarterback because then I really couldn't use it. Um, unless it was, like, the 90 overall Brady or, like, a fullback. A fullback wouldn't help. I really needed a wide receiver. Any other offensive posi line position except center and right guard. Those were literally the only two. I don't need tight end. Uh, I would have taken one of the high strong safeties or free. I need a cornerback. I need a defensive line here. I mean, there are plenty of, plenty of options, and I just didn't get it. Um, let's see. Okay, Richard Dent plays an 83 over there, so Richard Dent actually going to make the lineup here at the the left outside linebacker, or at left, out, left end position. Julius Peppers can go back to being a right or end. And so, yeah, that's the team. It's nothing special. Um, I'm just kind of sitting on my coins, waiting, biding my time. But, guys, that's going to do it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully, you guys pulled something better out of your 86-plus non-auctionable tradable elite. And I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out. Letting go, times we might feel like Looking down from the heights that we have.